Hey guys, it's your girl Debbie and I'm back with another list video for the channel. As you guys can see by the title, so this video is I also do a perfect twist out for your transitioning hair. So yes, I've not really tried twist out for my transitioning hair because I was like transitioning last um six months i think and i've not really had a chance to do it twist out most things i've been doing her bounce knots um flexi rods and stuff like that i've not really tried to twist out so it just wants to be something like a very very exciting thing to do in this video because not only am i um showing you guys how to do this i also want to see if um twist out on a seven month transitioning air it's going to be very nice because anytime i do um twist out on my relaxed air i'm always seeing like great results yeah but i've not really tried it like at this stage i'm in my transitioning so it's going to be a very very nice and lovely journey for me to see or i don't know if i should call it a journey but it's just going to be a, it's just going to be a very nice procedure to see if twist out on a seven month transition air is going to be very nice as um, a relaxed air so i want you guys to move along with me and also if you're new to this channel please hit the subscribe button and subscribe to this channel this channel is always lit and if you're new welcome back please like and comment what you think about this video and if you have other video ideas you want me to do comment it in the comment section and i'm going to reply to you and also don't forget to follow me on instagram at dt.asha and follow me on tiktok at dt.ash and also follow me on facebook at deborah at Debola. thank you so first of all i'm going to start with the neatly washed air i washed my air last today so it's still very uh, neat and you know uh, i'm gonna start with this so guys i'm eight months in um on my transitioning process now and to be honest i really don't know if i'm making progress or not i think my hair is um you know growing at its own pace i don't know how um uh, eight months hair is supposed to be but um this is what mine is looking like right now this is how much i've grown and this is how much growth i have now what do you think do you think it's impressive or not and uh, I really don't know the type of um a uh, I really don't know the type my hair type. I don't know if I'm 4B or 4A. Guys, if you know my hair type, please comment in the comment section because to be honest, I really don't know. I'm kind of like confused. I can't wait to like two years. I'm thinking of two years or one year. So the product I use for my twist out or the product I mostly use for my twist out is Eco Styler Gel for extra old and a detangling brush like i love using this detangling brush a lot it helps me it's easy to comb like you know very easy to brush through my hair and last but not least water at least i put a little bit of water for um you know okay so i'm going to be doing a middle part because i really really love middle parts i feel it um defines my face and makes me look prettier i don't know so what i'm going to do first is i'm going to section my hair into uh maybe six places so it's easy for me to you know walk my way through if you're wondering why i mostly use my hands to pass my hair it's because um type of air i have i don't really want to you know complicate it so much like if your hair is very very soft and easy for you to you know pat you can use a comb but i mostly use my hands because it's very like easy and safe and i know that okay i'm going to be very very gentle with it and i'm not going to cut it or manipulate my hair So I'm gonna start with this chunk. Um, I want to like take them little by little because when you do them like a big chunk like this one, it's definitely going to like, it's not going to dry quick. Because I'm trying to like uh, you know bag in for like um, overnight um, twist out overnight coils. You can take it for like longer than when I'm done. You know what I'm talking about. You can take the twist for like days if you want to. When you like, if you take it for days, you can put a lot of products in the hair and it's going to dry quick. But the one I want to do is overnight. So, because it's overnight now, you don't want to like put a lot of products in it and stuff. So, first of all, what I do is I use 
my spray bottle and I spray water in my hair so when I spray the water uh, I'm not gonna spray much because I don't want to spray much so what I do is I take um, the spray bottle then I spray it on my palm so by that I'll be able to measure or you know measure the amount of water I put in my hair because you know I don't want to put too much of product in my hair and it will not dry quick so I'm going to like you know just I just spray it in my on my palm you know put in my hair like that so after having the water and my hair is a little bit damp what I do is I take my eco styler gel then I take little chunks like this then you know after taking little chunks like this I rub it on my palm also and you know just saturate the hair like that like just put it on. so when you touch the air and you feel like there's not enough water you know to hold you can like also add a little bit of water so now that I've achieved what I want I'm now going to twist it up now what I'm going to do now is twist it and I'm going to twist it as tight as possible so it will not like get loose As you can see I'm done uh, I ended up doing um, it's twists so um, now that it's done I might end up using a blow dryer to like you know blow dry it for like uh, I'm gonna say 15 minutes after that I'm just going to air dry it all through the night so tomorrow I'm going to show you guys the results and you know see if it comes out fine it comes so out guys well. it's the next day and i still have my hair in those twists i woke up this morning i used the blow dryer to you know uh you know just blow the part that okay it's not dried yet now everything is pretty much dry so what i'm going to be doing first of all is no matter how many products you put in your hair you don't want to lose your twists with bare hands you don't want to lose your twist without putting oil in your hands because when you put oil on your palm then you lose your twist it's more neat and doesn't comes out frizzy so first of all i'm going to rub my hand with oil so it comes out neat and then i'm going to start by you know start gently you want to be gentle with it you don't want to be um rough with it
so you want to be gentle when you are um, separating your coils because if you want if you separate it too fast or you are too rough with it it's going to get rough it's going to get freezy How did this happen? Like, I don't understand. How did this happen? What is this on my head? Like, I was not expecting this at all. I was not expecting. I don't know if I did something wrong or, like, maybe because of I'm transitioning and like I'm like the style did not come out fine because I'm transitioning because I don't I don't even understand what this on my head. Like, it's never cute at all. Like, what's this? I decided to do a side pattern because I was thinking it's going to be fine now, so. But like, I don't understand, though, guys. Why? This is this is an epic feel. Like this is what we call epic feel because, well, <laughs> well, uh, it is what it is. All the procedures I showed you guys are very correct procedures. Don't blame on the father. I'm transitioning seven months. Though when you're transitioning, there are some hairstyles you don't want to do. Like when I watched a video, um, a YouTuber, she's into this transitioning stuff. She said that there's some hairstyles you don't want to do in transitioning. Like, when you're doing it before, it might come out fine, but when you're on the transitioning stage, it might not come out fine. So let me say, okay, let me just put the blame on the fact I'm transitioning because I've done twist outs a lot of times and it comes out very fine, very bam. So if it could not come out fine today, let me say it's because of that. And I told you guys for like seven months, I've not done a twist out. Seven months. I'm mo I mostly do back to knots and other styles. I don't do twist out. So me try to start now, and it will come out the way I'm expecting it to be. I feel it's because of I'm transitioning, and that's the reason why. So, uh, at least I tried it, and I know that I can't twist out to. I uh, finished transitioning, but um, I'm happy to like you know put this out there. I'm happy to um, you know move along with the experience and experimentize my hair to see if I can twist out a seven month transitioning hair. So now this is the result, and I hope you guys don't feel disappointed because I'm actually disappointed, but it's fine because I was thinking I was going to be looking bam and taking some Instagram pictures, but since I can't. Uh, I'm going to be trying other hairstyles too on my traditional hair, seeing if it's going to work. I've tried bouncing out a lot of times and it really works. But I'm going to try bouncing out coils for you guys, and you guys should see that that is very rare that that will work well because I do bouncing out every time. So now that I've tried this and you guys have seen the results, um, if you want me to do other styles, go to the comment section and comment the styles you want me to do. You'll be seeing more of me um, trying out new hairstyles on my channel. So if you know that you want to um, move along with the train, if you know you want to um, this channel and I'll be uploading bangers and nice videos for you. So thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!